your highness. You have good news of the turtle for me. It better be good. Well, that's the thing. We've, um, kind of lost them. What? You've lost them? How could this be? I'm sorry, your highness. They moved nation. They packed it all up and moved overnight. Our spies were sleeping, and when they woke, they were gone. With no trace. <sighs> That's okay. You tried your best. Why don't you go to the kitchens and have a feast? You deserve it, after all of your hard work. R really? Uh, you're not mad? Mad? No, no, no. We'll get them next time. Off you go now. You must be ravished. Oh, oh, thank you, evil one. You are truly the greatest leader. God. Yes, master? Throw him and his spies into the pit with the Death Claw. The Death Claw? Do you want to join him? No, sir. Right away. Guards, with me. It's too late for that. Men? No! Send out the trucker dragons. Find me that turtle and his scuba diver pet. <laughs> Hey, what's going on guys and welcome back to some more Minecraft Dragons with me Tiny Turtle and I am rocking my hoodie, check it out. Just a quick reminder before we get into this guys that the hoodie is still on sale for one week only so it's not going to be too much longer if you do want to grab it with your name on the back, the Myth Nation hoodie representing, then be sure to check out the link in the top of the description. But right now, we need to sort out a home for our new Night Furies. We saved the Night Furies last episode, guys, and check them out. The little baby Night Fury is so cool. He's got, like, white patches and stuff. Let's have a little fly down here. So I've cleared this area because I want to build them a nice little stables for their family. You know, this one looks exactly like Frost, which is crazy. There's the Daddy Night Fury, pretty happy. And then the little baby Night Fury. Look at his white belly. And then his white tail. Oh, he looks so much better. He was looking a bit weird before, but he looks great now. So, he's a mix of the two. But I do want to um, give them a little stables for them to sleep in. You know, they're new here. They're safer here. We got all the storm cutters up here keeping an eye on our nation. Watching the, uh, watching the whole island pretty much from afar. Because they're pretty high up. I mean, they can see everything course we've got the bewilder beasts over there oh it's starting to come together it's it's doing pretty good now i've got some supplies here and i think i'm gonna have to yeah i'm gonna have to make a crafting table and then get going with this because i do want to make this nice for them you know, they're just kind of wandering around not knowing what to do right now so once we get them a little home they can settle in and that will be uh that'll be much better for their for their um mindset they'll be a lot happier so let's get to it. Now, what does the dragon stables look like? You might be thinking. I have this new chisel as well, which makes the blocks look really, really cool. Uh, and I'm not really sure. You know, I'm just going to make one, maybe one big one. Should I make one big one? I think so. Let me see. I'll do it this way. So let's start like this. We'll do one uh, kind of area for them all to sleep in together because they will be much happier that way, I reckon. You don't want to split them up now. They've been split up enough. We got this. We're going to put this Night Fairy family back together. And feel good about it. It always feels good to help out. So let's do... So that's something like one. Got to make sure it's even. Oh, no. That's not even. Get rid of that. Okay. 
That's looking good, so let's bring it out a bit more. Obviously, we'll put some stuff around it. It's not going to just sit here like this, but it'll be nice. Uh, there, that's pretty big. I mean, where is the daddy knife here he gone? He went for a bit of a wander. We might have to go get him in a minute, but let's bring these guys in here and see if they'll all fit nicely. Do I have a sit stick? I don't have my sit stick with me. I need to teach them. Okay, you go in here in the middle. Now, where's your daddy? There he is. Oh, near the lava. Oh, he's taking a nap. He came up here and took a nap beside the lava. So I'm guessing he likes the heat off the lava. So we can definitely incorporate that down there. But although it is wood, we're going to have to be careful. Wake up, daddy. Okay, we're going to have to make sure. We're going to need names for all these guys. Oh, we're so... Like, I need to be able to call them something. No, 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 no. Where are you going? Oh, you're pretty disobedient, aren't you? These guys are good, but what's up with you? Okay, you know what? I need to go back to the house, grab my sit stick, and then if I can make him sit, he should be able to stay. Do I have it here somewhere? I mean, I I might have thrown it in. Oh, it's probably in the bedroom. Let me go and grab that. And there it is. Oh, I just love this design on the wall. Guys, it's on one of the merch designs if you guys want to grab it, but it is just so cool. That's Econ and Frost wrapped around the Myth Nation Ruby. It is just awesome, but we need to fill up more info on our dragons, but here we go. We got a disobedient knife fury who doesn't want to stay still, so we got to make him sit down. Oh, he's still in there. Okay, he hasn't left. Maybe he's just trying to get back up to the lava. And a little swoop. All right, buddy, where you going? Come here. Come here. Need to get some treats or something. Make them follow us. Hey. Okay, you stay there. You stay there. I'll bring you forward a bit. You're kind of lost in there. And you stay there. Hey. Let me turn you around a bit. Look at that lovely little Night Fury family. All happy. I'd say that's a pretty decent size if we want to go with that. So I could do... Uh, I have an idea. If I do like wooden fencing all the way up, that could be really nice. So I'm going to need a lot of sticks. And is it in the middle? I think this is how we're going to do it. Fence gates! No, I knew I was going to do that. It just makes no sense. No, it does make sense, I suppose. Okay. At least I have enough wood. So let's get a load more sticks. Uh, we need to put them in the middle. And then we need a load more wood. Okay, we don't have enough right now. 27. Yeah, we need more. We definitely need more. Let's get all that. Let's put them back in the middle. There we go. And you. And you. And that should do us for a little bit. Right. So what I'm thinking is if we do something like this. Okay, I'm going to have to put a block there. To turn that around the corner. And there. And there and there. So we're going to have to attach this all up. And now I can't jump up on fences. So this is going to be a bit annoying to build. But I'm going to do this pretty high. Like this is going to be nice. Then maybe put some vines and some flowers and stuff on the outside of it. That would be a nice little dragon stables, you know. Because it is only a newborn little uh, knife fury. Or what do I even call it? I mean, it's a mixture between a life fury and a knife fury, right? What is that? Because I know... Um, or oh, if you guys haven't seen the movie, I don't want to ruin anything. Uh, so I won't give you any hints on what's going on. But I do need to come up with a name for this guy. Like what we call him. So if you guys have any ideas in the comment section down below, I'll check them for next episode. And we can see. And get all the way across. I'll just get a little portion of this done, show you guys, see what you think, um, and then we can continue on from there. I'll just get it all finished. Oh, that's really far away. I thought I was trying to reach that. There we go. Oh, we'll do one more. We'll do one more up. At least, I think. If not, two more up. Maybe two more up. Can I reach up there again? I can. Nice. Yes. 
there. So that's the height it's going to be. So let's have a quick look at that now from in here. Because then there's going to be a block on top like this again. And then we put some vines and stuff. That is going to be nice. Maybe even a little bit higher. So let me do that really quick. And then I'll show you guys. And that is what I was talking about, guys. Something a little like this. I think it looks great. Let me know what you guys think. I'm not finished. Like I said, I want to do... Uh, I want to make it more nesty and more homey. So I'm just going to put a bit of hay in here. Because I, I noticed they did have hay at their nest before. And maybe that's because they have to make it out of like necessity. Or maybe they just really liked it. So I'm just going to put some down here. Where they can actually sleep on it. And maybe feel a little bit more at home. As if they were in their nest. That might, uh, that might help a little bit. You know, we want them to feel comfortable and happy. I know it's all a lot of new stuff here. Especially for the... Well, the little baby's new to everything anyway. Oh, I need more. Okay, I'm going to need quite a bit more. Um, I do want to do a bit of uh, water. Ooh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to use the chisel. Because watch this, guys. This is going to be cool. So what we're going to do... Is get a load of these bits. We need loads of these. Okay. Now, what we actually need to do is. Nope, oh, that's little bits. I need to put down a block. Three blocks. And then we're gonna do it around it. Ah! Hey, that just changed the grass. Okay, let's get drawn, region. Watch this, guys. It's gonna be cool. So we can use this as a giant kind of feeding. Or, well, not feeding, because we're gonna use it for water, but. Water bowl. Oh no, I need more. I need more. Give me more of this stuff. Okay. Oh, we only got to there? What? Okay, we had enough for that. Do we have enough for this? No. We are gonna need a lot of this stuff. Okay, that should do quite a bit now. Hey, we finished that off. And we finished that off. Nice, so now we break this out. We also break this out. And we gotta put a bottom on it. No, actually, we could just use... Actually, these. There you go. Now, this will actually hold water. I've said actually like four times. What's up with that? So this will hold water, as you can see. Look at that. That's nice. And it shouldn't flow out if I take a little bit off this, actually. <laughs> Why do I keep saying that? There you go. Now, a little, uh, a little thing for the dragons to drink out of. All right. And then I wanted to put some vines around to give them a bit of privacy as well. So let's just put a few up and then we can leave them be because that's pretty nice, I have to say. I'm really happy with that. And these are nice vines. Like, these aren't just any vines. He's got some flowers in them. When these grow, it's going to look pretty epic. Put them around there. Ooh. I'll get rid of all the building blocks after. We can reach these ones. Just about. I'm going to fall into something. And then I do need to figure out the uh, the lava. Because I know the daddy dragon likes to sleep by the heat. So we're going to have to maybe not put lava in there. Because it's wood. But we could put some sort of heat system. I mean, we could have like a vent with lava under the ground that's kind of spewing the, the steam, the hot air up. Then a few more. And then we just step back and admire. Ooh. Ooh. Oh no, I've got to climb one more. And ooh, it's, get, it's getting pretty late. I mean, probably time for bed soon. So maybe I'll just feed all the dragons, head to bed, and see what tomorrow has to offer in terms of uh, an adventure. See if we can go out somewhere. See if Scuba Steve's going to be back soon. He's been out for a while. I'm not sure what he's up to. I didn't actually ask. So I don't know what he's doing. But we'll, we'll go check after. All right, let's admire this now. See how it looks. And... Hey, looks exactly the same. We need more hay. Maybe fill all inside with hay. But let these uh, vines grow. See what happens. I actually did get some hanging baskets as well. Let's see how these work. Are these nice? Can I put that there and then put like that there? Oh, I like it. I like it. You guys have got like the best stables in here. Well, the only ones at the minute, but you have a little baby, so that's fair. 
And there is a little baby volcano dragon. We need to figure him out as well. But I think I'm going to go and get settled in for the night. These guys look good. Uh, obviously, there's a lot of work to do around here. But that is a good start for the Night Fury family. I'm sure they're going to be feeling a lot better in there. That stuff's going to grow a bit overnight. So let's hit the uh, let's hit the bed and wait and see if hopefully Scuba Steve's back for the, tomorrow's adventure. See where we can go, what we can do. All right, let's go. <laughs> no good nation kicking me out. I only stole a thousand gold. Oh well, I don't need them. I'll be fine by myself. I'll start my own nation, full of thieves and pirates. Ooh, land. That ought to do. Now, let's see what this island has for me. Whoa, a baby like that would fetch me 10,000 gold. That would give me enough to start up my own nation. <laughs> 